of Microsoft Excel, you will learn how to create stock sale or purchase sheet. The sheet I am going to create is very much simple. First of all, I will type serial, I will create first column with the name serial number. Then I will create second column with the name products. This column will shows items or products which are available in the stock. Third column will be named stock. This will show the number of products which are present in the stock. Another column I will create with the name of sold. Here you will find the number of products which have already been sold. And a new column will be purchased. Here I will show the new items which have been purchased. And at the end, I will create a column of total left. This will show the total number of products left. I will click, I will select four columns from here and then I will click home and then I will merge them and I will type here stock sale purchase sheet. Now here I will type one and then I will drag it down. From this autofill option, I will click more option and then I will click fill series and it will be filled. Now I will select my working area. Then I will click view and then zoom selection. Now my working area will appear clearly before me. So my work will become easy. Now products, for example, it is a company which deals with the products like school furniture. What it will contain? It will contain dices, benches, chairs, tables. What more a school can contain? I say, round tables now from here I will stretch it a little bit so the text fits well in the cell now in stock for example I have 10 dices in my stock 15 benches 25 chairs 30 tables, 10 round tables, out of which 5 have been sold, 10 have been sold, out of 25 chairs, 10 have been sold, out of 30, 15 have been sold, and round tables, 4 round tables have been sold. Now, let's say I have purchased 4 dices, new dices, 5 benches, chairs, for 6 new chairs, 7 tables, and eight round tables. Now, how much products have been left in my stock? For this, I will use a formula and you know that every formula starts with an equal sound sign. I will type equal. Then what I will do? I will add stock column. I will click 10. Then plus I will add purchased and then I will subtract the sold one and click enter and I have left with nine dices. When the sign of the cursor will change to plus, I will drag it down and I will get the results. I have left with 10 benches, 11 chairs, 22 tables and 14 round tables. This is, there may be a sale purchase list which can be little bit complicated but I have shared with you a very simple stock sale purchase sheet this is how you can create stock sale purchase sheet in Microsoft Excel.
If this video helps you in any way, please subscribe my channel and hit the like button. Thanks for watching. Thanks for your time. Goodbye.